At General Motors, our vision for the future is a world with zero crashes, zero emissions, and zero congestion. Back in 2018, we announced our belief in an all-electric future. It's a bold goal, but GM's CEO has revealed a revolutionary new engine that could completely transform the automotive industry. This new technology promises to disrupt the traditional car market, potentially leaving competitors scrambling to keep up. General Motors, a company that has its roots in the 19th century, is determined to prove that it's not your grandfather's GM. Under the leadership of Mary Burra, the company has doubled its investment in electric vehicle development. Elon Musk is celebrating this move as it addresses one of the biggest concerns for EV owners, range and charging. This new engine could be the key to reshaping the entire car industry, and GM believes it will allow them to build 1 million EVs by 2025. The automotive industry has been a hub of technological innovation for over a century. Companies like General Motors, Ford, and Toyota have vied for supremacy in the competitive car market. But now, the battle has reached a new peak. GM's new engine technology is poised to redefine power, efficiency, and performance in vehicles, signaling a new dawn for the car industry. Many are speculating that this engine could mark the beginning of the end for traditional players in the industry. So, what makes this engine so special? According to reports, GM's new engine is based on a breakthrough technology that combines elements of traditional combustion engines and electric motors. It utilizes a revolutionary new combustion process known as Homogeneous Charge Compression Ignition, HCCI. HCCI ignites the air-fuel mixture through compression rather than spark plugs, offering the efficiency of a diesel engine with the emissions profile of an electric motor. This innovation could achieve fuel efficiency levels that were once thought impossible for a gasoline engine, rivaling or even surpassing many electric vehicles. For years, electric vehicles have been seen as the future of transportation, with companies like Tesla leading the charge. However, GM's new engine could challenge this narrative. If it proves to be as efficient and clean as claimed, it could slow the growth of the electric vehicle market and force traditional automakers to rethink their strategies. In conclusion, GM's new engine represents a turning point in the automotive industry, offering a cleaner and more efficient alternative that could reshape the global car market. Whether this technology will truly revolutionize the industry or pave the way for more innovation remains to be seen, but it's clear that the automotive industry is entering a new era, and General Motors is poised to lead the charge. Toyota made a bold move by modifying its engines to ensure seamless compatibility with hydrogen, leaving many puzzled. The million-dollar question is, how did Toyota maintain the engine's stellar performance while transitioning to a new fuel source? The hydrogen combustion process is a delicate balance between fuel and engine, precisely orchestrated to deliver top-notch performance without compromising efficiency or environmental friendliness. Compared to gasoline, hydrogen poses new challenges in handling and burning, which is why Toyota's advanced high-pressure hydrogen direct injection system is a far cry from traditional fuel injection setups. This system regulates hydrogen injection into the combustion chamber, optimizing both performance and efficiency. Despite running on hydrogen, Toyota's 1.6L engine packs serious power, thanks to a turbocharger, which ensures the engine gets the extra boost it needs. There has been some debate about whether turbocharging is suitable for hydrogen engines, given hydrogen's unique properties. Since hydrogen isn't as dense as gasoline, it requires more fuel to produce the same energy. But Toyota's engineers have optimized the turbocharger and other parts to handle these challenges, resulting in an engine that is not only efficient, but also super efficient. Hydrogen combustion engines are more efficient than traditional ones, particularly during heavy-duty tasks. This means better fuel economy and less environmental harm. Toyota's CEO emphasized that the company's commitment to achieving near-zero emissions with hydrogen engines isn't a temporary trend but part of their broader mission to fight climate change and move towards carbon neutrality. They are embracing a multifaceted approach combining hydrogen and electric technologies, expanding their investment across the board, from buses and trucks to forklifts and power generation. Hydrogen's eco-friendly profile and versatility make it a promising fuel source for various sectors, including transportation, industry, and energy storage. By using renewable energy like wind or solar to produce hydrogen, Toyota is building a sustainable energy ecosystem.
Their strategy isn't just about achieving near-zero emissions, it's about promoting sustainability across society. Toyota's hydrogen technology has been incorporated into commercial vehicles and public transportation, and the company isn't limiting itself to just one strategy but also embracing electric vehicle technology to achieve their goal of carbon neutrality. Toyota has realized that different regions have varied energy sources and regulations, so a one-size-fits-all approach won't work. In areas powered by renewable energy, battery electric vehicles are ideal. However, where hydrogen production from renewables is viable, fuel cell electric vehicles and hydrogen internal combustion engine vehicles might be better options. Toyota's commitment extends beyond tailpipe emissions to revolutionizing its manufacturing processes, promoting recycling, using resources efficiently, and investing in renewable energy. Achieving a nearly carbon-neutral society is a monumental task that requires addressing vehicle technology and energy generation. Toyota is tackling these challenges head-on with a multi-pronged strategy, providing both environmental benefits and technological advancements. The secret behind hydrogen engines lies in their combustion process. When hydrogen burns, it combines with oxygen to create water vapor, which is the only emission. This is a game-changer compared to hybrid electric vehicles, HEVs, and plug-in hybrid electric vehicles, PHEVs, which still emit carbon dioxide. Hydrogen engines offer true zero-emission driving and a more sustainable overall life cycle, especially when hydrogen is produced from renewable sources. Toyota's hydrogen combustion engines excel in heavy-duty applications and outperform traditional engines in efficiency and performance under pressure. Toyota has showcased the durability and potential of hydrogen-powered vehicles in motorsports, proving that they can compete with traditional cars in speed, agility, and endurance. Hydrogen's fast-burning nature results in lightning-fast responsiveness, delivering a driving experience similar to that of traditional internal combustion engines, including the familiar rumble and power. Toyota tested these engines in racing, highlighting their high performance and reliability. Hydrogen combustion engines can rival and sometimes surpass the power outputs of traditional engines, indicating that hydrogen could revolutionize high-performance vehicles. Toyota's approach to carbon neutrality is multifaceted, and while the company has been a pioneer in hybrid and plug-in hybrid vehicles since the introduction of the Prius in 1997, it has been cautious about embracing fully electric vehicles. The rush to electric vehicles has left many concerns unaddressed, including the lack of infrastructure and the impact on the power grid. Akio Toyoda, Toyota's former CEO, argued that EVs are overhyped and that having too many could be dangerous due to high costs and lack of support. Despite opposition from other automakers embracing the switch to electric vehicles, Toyota has maintained that hydrogen-powered technology will be a crucial component in the future automotive landscape. Akio Toyoda believes this new engine will challenge the entire EV market, providing an alternative that could coexist with electric vehicles in the transition to a sustainable future. Concerns regarding the environmental effects of battery production and disposal, along with the lack of charging infrastructure, support Toyota's arguments against the widespread adoption of electric vehicles, EVs. First, there isn't enough power to support a significant increase in electric vehicles, and second, fossil fuels remain the primary source of electricity globally. Consequently, increasing the number of electric vehicles may not reduce emissions, it would merely shift their source. Detractors of this viewpoint may overlook Akio Toyota's assertion that carbon, rather than combustion engines, is the true enemy. A broad examination reveals that the adoption of electric vehicles is uneven across the globe. While markets in Europe and China are advancing rapidly, the United States lags behind, and regions like Africa have minimal to no EV infrastructure. This disparity suggests that the global shift toward all electric vehicles is premature. Toyota argues that a complete transition to electric vehicles would leave many consumers in the dark, especially given that in 2021, the company sold over 10.5 million units across more than 200 nations, securing significant market penetration, particularly in developing countries with inadequate charging infrastructure. By 2035, many of these areas are unlikely to develop the necessary infrastructure to support electric vehicles. Electric vehicles are also costly, often only appearing affordable due to government subsidies aimed at encouraging their purchase. The sustainability of these incentives is uncertain, especially as mass production ramps up. 
without financial support, many potential buyers may hesitate to invest in electric vehicles. Toyota advocates for a balanced approach, emphasizing hybrid vehicles rather than a full switch to electric. The company is actively exploring hydrogen-powered vehicles as an alternative. By promoting hydrogen-powered cars as a zero-emission substitute for gasoline and diesel vehicles, Toyota is developing a new internal combustion engine that burns hydrogen, potentially disrupting the electric vehicle market. Lithium-ion batteries power electric vehicles, with lithium being a crucial component in their manufacture. However, lithium is not abundant, and as electric vehicle production increases, a shortage is anticipated. Toyota's team highlights this concern and suggests a dual solution. Instead of producing larger batteries for electric vehicles, they propose making smaller batteries for hybrid cars. This strategy could mitigate the lithium shortage by using more batteries with limited lithium while ensuring hybrid vehicles emit fewer emissions than traditional cars. The implications of an all-electric future remain uncertain, but Toyota warns that transitioning to electric vehicles will strain global metal resources, increasing the demand for nickel and manganese alongside lithium. This may drive up battery costs and, in turn, vehicle prices. Toyota believes relying on government incentives is risky and highlights that only a small fraction of new cars sold are fully electric, allowing room for alternative vehicles. Focusing on hydrogen combustion engines, Toyota introduces the Corolla Cross H2 concept, which features a new hydrogen internal combustion engine prototype. The 1.6L three-cylinder turbocharged engine, adapted from the GR Corolla and GR Yaris, showcases technology developed through Toyota's FCEV. The Mirai. This hydrogen technology requires storage in robust fuel tanks, with enhancements made to connecting rods, valves, and fuel injectors. The Cross H2 concept can accommodate five passengers and their belongings, similar to a regular Corolla. In an exciting collaboration, Toyota and Yamaha are developing a hydrogen fueled V8 engine based on the Lexus RC Coupe engine. This 5.0L V8 engine, modified for hydrogen, is expected to produce 398 pound-foot of torque at 3,600 rpm and 455 horsepower at 6,800 rpm, offering performance comparable to traditional gasoline engines. Hydrogen fueling is also a significant advantage, filling a hydrogen-powered vehicle takes just 1.5 minutes, considerably quicker than filling a gasoline vehicle. Hydrogen's performance in extreme temperatures is superior to that of conventional fuels. It can withstand temperatures as low as minus 435 degrees Fahrenheit, making it suitable for cold climates, unlike diesel and gasoline. Additionally, lithium batteries struggle in colder temperatures, which can limit their effectiveness. The materials required to produce lithium batteries are also in short supply, prompting concerns about future production capabilities. Despite electric vehicles' increasing popularity, Many classic car enthusiasts cherish the visceral experience of driving traditional combustion engine vehicles. Hydrogen-powered vehicles can provide a similar thrill, utilizing technology that is more familiar and manageable than electric powertrains, which often require specialized knowledge for repairs. Hydrogen engines resemble traditional engines more closely, making them easier to maintain at local repair shops. Toyota's approach to carbon neutrality is more varied than that of many competitors who are solely focused on electric vehicles. This perspective seems increasingly relevant as European nations grapple with energy shortages stemming from geopolitical tensions, like those arising from the conflict in Ukraine. For example, Switzerland has suggested that electric vehicle owners limit their usage to emergencies, a policy that may soon become law. While hydrogen fuel cell electric vehicles, FCEVs, hold significant potential, technological advancements are needed for widespread adoption. Currently, hydrogen production is costly and heavily reliant on fossil fuels, with 99% of hydrogen production stemming from non-renewable sources. Consequently, a push toward renewable hydrogen production methods is crucial to enhance public interest in hydrogen vehicles. The infrastructure for hydrogen refueling stations is currently lacking, with only about 60 locations in the US, mostly in California, and a few in Canada. For hydrogen vehicles to succeed, accessible refueling stations are essential. Additionally, the cost of hydrogen remains high, comparable to gasoline prices, with fluctuations reaching up to $12 per gallon. For hydrogen vehicles to thrive, 
this cost must be lowered to about $2 per gallon, similar to gasoline. Despite these challenges, hydrogen fuel cell electric vehicles offer a potential solution to the limitations of electric vehicles. While the production of hydrogen is energy-intensive and currently unsustainable, advancements in technology may facilitate the development of affordable, eco-friendly methods for hydrogen production. If successful, hydrogen fuel cell vehicles could compete effectively with electric vehicles, providing drivers with viable alternatives. Ultimately, both battery electric vehicles and hydrogen combustion engine vehicles have the potential to contribute significantly to sustainable transportation. It is unlikely that either technology will fully replace the other, instead, they will coexist, serving different functions based on consumer preferences and needs.